my reader friends. Welcome back to Story Time. Today we have another story. It's called Pete the Cat and the Cruel Caterpillar. But before we get started, please subscribe and look carefully through the pages because there is a little chick following Pete. Now keep an eye on it as we read this story. So let's get started. Pete is on a bug safari. He and his friends are looking for bugs. How many bugs can they find? Callie spots a tiny black ant. It's building an ant hill. Hill, she says. Groovy, says Pete. Gus finds a round red ladybug in the mint patch. It has nine spots, says Gus. Nice, says Pete. Marty sees a big black spider. It caught a fly, he says. Neat, says Pete. Pete finds a green caterpillar in the flower pot. I'll bring bring it home to show mom and dad. Mom helps Pete build a home for the caterpillar. They use a big jar. Dad puts lots of little holes in the lid for air. Pete puts the caterpillar in the jar. Pete. Put some leaves in a jar for the caterpillar to eat. It. He adds a twig for it to crawl on. Good night, Pete says. Mom. Good night, Pete says. Dad. Good night, caterp caterpillar says. Pete. When Pete wakes up, the caterpillar is gone. Where did it go? Did it run away? It is not gone says. Mom. It did not run away. Says Dad. Look, they say, the caterpillar is inside there. Says Mom. It's called a pupa. Will stay there in there forever? Pete asks. No, says Dad. The caterpillar is changing to something new. Will it become? What will it become? Pete asks. It is a surprise. Says Mom, you, we must wait and see. Pete waits. Callie comes to visit. Did he come out yet? He asks. Not yet. Says Pete. Pete waits some more. Gus comes to visit. Did he come out yet? He asks. Not yet. Says Pete. Pete waits even longer. Marty comes to visit. Did he come out yet? He asks. Not yet, says Pete. Pete waits and waits and waits. <gasps> Then one day, something finally happens. The pupa starts to wiggle. Something is happening. It wiggles some more. Everyone comes over to watch. The pupa cracks open. Something is coming out. Who? Can, what can it be? A head pokes out. Then some legs. And then two colorful wings. Wow! The caterpillar changed into a beautiful butterfly. Wow! Says Pete. The butterfly slowly moves. It its wings up and down. It is ready to fly. They take the jar to the park. Time to say goodbye, said Dad. Pete opens the lid of the jar. The butterfly flaps its wings. It flutters out of the jar and lands on Pete's nose. That tickles, he says. Then the butterfly flies up into the sky. Bye bye, butterfly! Everyone says. Let's find. Let's find a new caterpillar. Says Pete, change is pretty cool. The end. I hope you like the story. Make sure to subscribe and watch all my other reading aloud videos.
videos on my channel, Storytime. See you in another reading aloud video. Bye, reader friends. Always happy reading.